Yo, what's going on, guys? It is I see you. Welcome back. So we're using the HG40 again, and we're we don't have any attachments on it. And at least the freaking skin's loaded this time. There's, there's not even a skin on it because I've just freaking prestiged it. Which is why I don't have any attachments. But we're going to attempt to get a win right now without any attachments on this gun. Which will be close to impossible. But like I said, you don't want to freaking uh, rush too much with this gun. You gotta got to be the first person to shoot on these homies. This gun's just hard to even land your shots to begin with. Like... You can boost around with the VMP and still land all your shots. This thing just freaking, especially with no attachments, it's just, like, look at that, man. Like, look how many freaking bullets. So I'm one kill right now, one and one. The next guy above me is three, but the top score is what we got to worry about, and he's at five kills. Now he's at six. Okay, he's pulling out his freaking HG40, it sounded like, too, but obviously he has attachments on his. But let's freaking make moves over here. Be aware of our surroundings. Grab that guy. We're only down by three kills right now, which leaves me without a worry in the world that we actually have a chance to get a win right now. See, like, look. I had first shot on that guy easy, and he still almost killed me. Like, that was some BS, and that's why the HG40 needs to be buffed. Buff it. Give it to everyone. How about that, Treyarch? That's not necessarily a good idea. Leave in the comments down below. Buff the gun and give that gun to everyone. It was the first DLC weapon that you guys released. Just make a day where you spend 90 crypto keys and you give one specialist weapon. Is how you advertise it. You'll give one specialist weapon and then just make the majority of it be the MP40 and then or the HG40 and then buff it. Does it how how is that not like a normal idea? Like you have people or do it where you hit master prestige or guaranteed one weapon. I mean like. Come on, people that play your game all the way to Master Prestige, you're not going to guarantee them one specialist weapon? That doesn't make any sense. That kind of pisses me off, to be honest. Like, for as much as people play the game, I see people that don't play it nearly as much, and they still have more shit. It's like, how is that cool? Like, they don't even spend as much money and shit, and they still have, you know, all the sick shit. Like, that's not how it works, but, um... Whoa, whoa, whoa. So that guy got wrecked by my hive, which was... Probably the best thing that could have ever happened to him, considering he was probably on the bottom of the scoreboard anyways. Boom, 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 boom. Wrecked. Wrecked. Alright. I hear a scythe over there. I'm not very rushy with this gun, like I said, but we're to rush right here. There's that guy. He's got a YouTube channel, according to his emblem there. Alright, at least we got a UAV. That's going to help us out a good, decent amount right now. Because now we'll be able to see them on the map and do all that jazz. But let's freaking mob up here real quick. Slide. Whoa, I should have known better. And that's the guy on top right now? What the fuck? This guy's going the other way? He's probably coming through here. No, he's not. That guy was one shot straight out of Nuketown. Do you guys see that emblem? Alright, so we just unlocked quick draw on this thing, which means that we've leveled it up a little bit. This guy's one shot over here, man. One thing that I will say that's nice about this gun is the reload is decently fast. And the damage is somewhat decent, I guess. Like, this is really just like, you gotta get the feel for this gun. Another thing that's alright about this gun is the hip fire is not too shabby. For it being such a slow fire, uh, firing rate weapon, the hip fire, actually a decent amount of the bullets will end up hitting him when you aim, obviously, somewhat good at him. You'd think that you'd probably just miss almost all of them because you... Like, look. Like, that's pretty decent for a hip fire from that range. Um, I'm gonna land these down real quick. Rush that. I hate how the hive will. I was gonna say I hate how the hive. Hold on. I hate how the hive will like freaking just straight. It will use all its hives even though it's already got him dead once the first one went off. 
That's one thing I don't like about the hive, but either way, once you die, they're pretty much all gone. So we're down by six kills right now. Okay, you guys can see what I deal with. This gun just does not have the bullet power that some of these other weapons have, dude. Just to slay, especially in free-for-all when you literally just need to really have a dominant KD over everyone else in order to win. Now this guy's fucking six kills above us. This guy's got the scythe, but he's down for the count now. I'm gonna drop a quick reload. This guy's gotta be coming. There's that guy. This guy's already at seven damn kills, and I know he's right here. Die. Spawn him over there. Spawn him over there so I can kill him again. There's that guy. This guy's up top rock. He's gonna try to kill me right now. How do you kill me when you're getting shot by that guy and me? That doesn't make any sense. Alright, where you at? Where you at? Final killing blow, bitch. Where you at? That's him right there, and I almost killed him before he got the kill with the F. But, uh, it's gonna wrap it up. This gun sucks. It's nothing compared to the VMP or any other gun, as we concluded from this damn match. And I almost killed him right there. But I'll see you in the next one.